Here we go. Hey, everyone that's on there. I appreciate everybody joining for this week's Training Tuesday. My name's Heidi Reese. I'm hanging out here with Andy Grisky, and we are going to be talking about high-rise infrastructure and introduction to the solution lines and construction. Um, again, welcome aboard. Just a couple of items to go over for today's Training Tuesday. Um, so, you know, if you have dogs, we've muted everybody except for Andy now and myself so that we don't hear the dogs barking or, you know, the kids coming in so that everybody can hear the same presentation. We are recording it. So if you want to listen to it later on, we post these on our YouTube channels as well as DaytonSuperior.com. All you have to do is search for Training Tuesdays and you get two links. One is for registering for the next one. And the second will go to all of the videos that we have out there. Okay, so this presentation is for training purposes only. Anything that we will be discussing within this presentation can be found on DaytonSuperior.com. So we have technical as well as safety data sheets, so any of that information can be found there. So who is Dayton Superior? We are the leading provider of engineered solutions. We specialize in accessories, chemicals, forming, engineering, and training. And we are going to talk a lot more about that throughout this presentation. There's a lot of infrastructure, so that doesn't mean that we're all accessories and we're all chemicals. It's like a blend. We are the one-stop shop for your needs. That includes training, as you're seeing here. If you need customized training, you can contact us. We'll give you a resource page at the end in order to do that, as well as many other items. So I'm going to let Andy talk about that in just a few. I'm going to introduce him first, though. So like I said, we're talking about introduction to high-rise solutions. And with us today is Andy Gretzky, who is the Director of Business Development for Infrastructure. He has been within the construction industry for over 15 years and has worked as a sales and business development manager throughout. One of his many specialties is in the federal and civil construction field. He worked with engineering firms, contractors, utility companies, and many more other areas of the business. He uses his degree from the University of Wisconsin Stevens Point, along with that experience within the industry, as well as his strategic planning skills. And that makes him key in driving our infrastructure segment for Dayton Superior. So let's get to it and hear from Andy and learn all about high-rise construction solutions. Go ahead, Andy. All right, well, thank you very much, Heidi, and welcome everybody today. Thanks for joining us. Uh, so I'm just gonna start briefly with the goals, what we want to help provide to you, uh, not just today's Training Tuesday, but every Training Tuesday, is to provide you multiple solutions that are gonna help increase your return on investment. And we look to do this with a focus on increased worker safety. And I can't stress this enough that the most important part of every job is knowing that every employee goes home every night. So even though we are a manufacturer, safety is always paramount for us and we take that very seriously. We also focus on increased reliability and efficiency, which will improve your profit through lower operating costs and the lower cost of ownership. When we move to the next slide, <clears throat> we'll, I want to focus on knowing that Simons and Dayton Superior are two of the most recognizable names in the concrete industry. As Heidi already mentioned, we specialize in Simons forming and shoring, concrete repair and restoration, bridge deck, rebar splicing, precast and tilt up construction. If you see concrete being poured somewhere, there's a good chance either a Simons or a Dayton Superior project is on that job. Now, when Simons forming and shoring, it's, our systems are adaptable, they're strong, and they save a lot of labor costs by being easy to use. We also have the largest and most experienced engineering and sales team in the industry, and we offer world-class customer care and 24-hour ordering and account status information. Our technical support team is here to provide you project-specific solutions so that we get your project done on time and fingers crossed, hopefully under budget. Uh, don't forget, we are always here to provide training. We have sector leaders, product specialists, chemical specialists. We also have the one and only Chuck Hoke who has forgotten more about concrete than most of us will ever know. 
we can bring the training to you and they will be customized to your organization's needs. So don't ever hesitate to reach out for something like that. <clears throat> Excuse me. Moving on, <clears throat> we pride ourselves on making sure that we provide solutions that fit your specific project. And we also provide pride ourselves on being here to help you with your project from pre-construction engineering all the way to finish. So even if you start on that list from the bottom up, start with engineering, the shoring, the forming, chemicals and accessories. We're here through your entire project, which means we don't just sell it to you and walk away. We're your partner on this. When you need us, just call. We're here when you have questions. We're here if you need something changed or added to what you're already working on. But first, I think we'll start with the Simons forming and shoring. So the most important thing that I'd like to stress about our forming systems, and you'll see in these pictures right here, uh, <clears throat> these are some of the columns, walls, and slabs that you'll see our, shore, our forms on. But we also have forming designs for all concrete forms. If you need to form it, we can handle it, and we can help you figure out how to do it the right way. You'll see some of our standard applications with our forming system here. <clears throat> Most of the pictures you'll see our Simply system. These do all come in standard sizes, but our systems can also be customized for any forming needs. Because I have yet to meet an engineer or an architect that thinks everybody should be in six by six, every building should be in six by six straight lines. They don't build them that way, so our systems don't need to operate that way. We're here to make sure we can accommodate what you need. Moving along, you'll see that we also have some of our core and wall applications. And what I wanted to show you here is that our systems can be used to create, to build and create gang forms for some of the core and wall applications that you see in those photos as well. But that's not all we do with forming. Uh, we have three different uh, shoring systems. Now, the first one I'm showing you here is our frame fast system. And this comes in eight standard sizes. This is the simplest forming system that we have. Now, when it comes to shoring, this is a system the contractors have used for many years and they stick with it because of the simplicity of the system and it's something they're comfortable with. You know, we don't always like the phrase, this is the way we've always done it, but for shoring contractors, if they know it and they can do it in their sleep, why change if you don't have to? Now we do have other systems that are faster and a little bit cleaner, but this really is the simplest tried and true system that we offer. And if we look at the next slide, we'll see that you can see the components of our frame fast shoring system. There's just not a lot to it. Between the stringer, the screw jacks, the cross braces and the frames, there's really not a lot to it. Now we don't show the plywood in this photo because obviously that would go on the top, but it is very simple to use. It can be a little bit more time consuming because you do have more pieces, but it's very easy to, to get it on the job site and get through it. But I did promise you that we do have some simpler and easier systems to use. So next I'd like to talk about our drop head shoring system. Now, <clears throat> this is our newest and fastest system for form and pore slabs. Essentially, it's the newest generation of our form fast system. We call this the drop head shoring system. This is terrific for a large area single story structure. If it's a flat slab with drop head band, beam, band beams, uh, this is terrific because it goes up fast and you can cover a lot of sp space in a short amount of time. But this is also a great fit if you're building a metropolitan high rise because you will have a lot of multiple typical floors, right? They're all the same. And this is very close to a modular system where you can continually build these modular floors one on top of the other. Material is hoisted inside the building, so it saves time from having to take it all down, go outside, lift it back up. Now you can't use tables on these, but you can open this underneath the slab, which allows you to work on the previous poured slab. So it's very quick and easy to use. And there are some more benefits that we'll look at on the next slide here. <laughs> it's time and cost savings. It employs imperial dimensions with six foot by eight foot grid. There's 25% fewer posts in it. You're gonna realize lower cost because 70% of the material 
is recovered day one after a pour. Everything is reusable. And I know you'll ask, well, what's the 30% we don't reuse? Those are gonna be the chunks of plywood that you cut to shape for filling that, that slab that you're pouring. But these are very quick and very easy to use. And if you haven't seen one of our videos on YouTube about the drop head system, where you'll see two guys essentially putting this together, I encourage you to find that at another time when you've got some free time. Now we also offer one more shoring system and that's our deck fast shoring system. Now this is a panelized system and the standard panel sizes are roughly six by six, uh, but we do have smaller panels which will accommodate smaller sizes. And uh, the benefit to this also is that you can go from six foot nine to 19 foot clearance heights. It does assemble four times faster than conventional shoring. <clears throat> and it will support the 22 inch thick slab just like our drop head system will. Now, I know this is a brief overview and you may have some more specific questions after the presentation. Do not hesitate to reach out. We will absolutely get the right expert in touch with you so that they can answer every question you might have. Now, <clears throat> one, uh, one or two last things on forming and showing that I wanted to share. When you get your system delivered, we have a detailed list and detailed drawings for how you're gonna be able to put your, uh, your job together. If that's still not helping you, call us. We've got the right people that'll be there to help you get this done. But all forming and showing systems are detailed for your job. Now, I know we can't talk about forming all day, although I'm sure all of you would love to, uh, but we will have to move on to accessories. <clears throat> and if you're gonna pour concrete, you're gonna use rebar, which means you have to support your bar. And we have it all literally, whether it's metal or plastic, whatever support chairs you need, we have that available. So you saw the metal, you saw the plastic. <clears throat> we also have our D55 metal strip, which is a two piece prepackaged dowel bar keyway strip which is designed to maintain continuity of reinforcement at joints in concrete. Now, typically you'll see this in splicing. This is typically for splicing in an elevator core shaft, uh, but these do need to be used properly. And if you are gonna use it again, if you don't have experience with it, give us a call. We have plenty of people that can be there or walk you through this. Um, you know, there are specific uses for this and we wanna make sure that we have it available for you when you need it. On the next slide, of course, you'll see some of the installation photos of, of where that D55 has been used. <clears throat> Excuse me. And since every picture tells a story, we'll leave it at that. Now, moving on, we also have our splicing systems. Uh, the DBDI, this is a terrific uh, threaded bar system, and it is a forged system. Uh, the best part about this is there are no tools required. It's very easy to install but it is only av available in grade 60, number four through number 11 rebar. Now we do have more for, uh, for longer and thicker rod and we'll get to that next. But remember, if you need to move quickly, this is an absolutely terrific uh, system to use for rebar splicing. Our taper lock system is very popular. Uh, it's the most economical option, hands down for bridges and high rises. It's a taper threaded mechanical splicing system. Again, no installation tools. It's hand tight at five foot pounds. We do place the threading machines with the fabricators so these can get done close to the job. Uh, although we can also use tight, I mean, grade 60, 75, 80 bar, uh, all rebar sizes, number 40, I mean, number four through number 12, number 14 and number 18. Uh, we can handle a lot of different bar applications through this. Now, we also have our D350 and D351 taper lock end anchors. These are used when you need rebar end anchorage. These are a very popular accessory, mostly due to the ease of installation and the cost effectiveness. And you'll get a full strength approved end anchor. Now, in these photos, you'll notice it doesn't look like much because let's face it, construction doesn't always look great when you're building it, but this is from the grade 100 foundation of the JP Morgan Chase World Headquarters. Uh, so if you're ever there, 
you can see you're walking on our end anchors. Not that's why you'd go there, but it would be fun to tell people. And they'd look at you and not know what you're talking about. Now, our bar lock system is also another option for splicing. Uh, these are typically used more for vertical applications, but this is a great system when you're doing repair and rehab applications because it doesn't require any bar end preparation. It's a simple sleeve that you can lock two bars together, tighten them down properly until your bolts are gonna snap <clears throat> because they are locked to your bolts, put them together, move on, and you're ready to go. Now, because I did mention before, we do take safety very seriously. I am remiss if I do not mention the A93C SureGuard rail post. That's a, a long way of just calling it the slab grabber uh, because this is very important. If any job site you've seen uh, railings and, and tiebacks, this is a very simple, very easy to use post, which if you look at the next slide even, where you can see it in a picture, it gives it a little bit better idea of how it works. The more important part is it's a 30 pound post. It's designed to withstand the toughest job conditions. It's a drop pin that makes sure it's simple and efficient. You do need to make sure it's secured to the deck with the proper fasteners, but this can more importantly be used on cast in place and precast slabs. So any job site, you can find a, an area to be safe in. And lastly, we're gonna talk a little bit here about chemicals because as we mentioned in the beginning, we wanna be here from engineering all the way to the end. So one of the first things we'll just touch on briefly are, is our grout line. All the way from our 1107 up to our turbo grout, we have every type that you're gonna need. And if you don't know what you need, just give us a call. We can help walk you through what you'll need for the application that you have. We also offer repair mortars. <laughs> and again, it doesn't matter the application, we have a repair mortar for it. It might be civil and structural. It might be a vertical application. It might be just a thin resurfacing you're doing or you need an architectural finish. It may depend on your preference, how fast or how slow are you patching? What are you working on? If you don't know, we have the experts in house that can help walk you through what you might need. They might even be able to ask questions you hadn't thought of, which will help determine the product that's gonna work best for you. Our epoxy, we have a very extensive offering of epoxies. Our injections, our grouts, and our adhesives. Whatever the conditions, we have something for you. And if you don't know what you need, I know it's redundant, give us a call. We'll talk you through what you need to get. <clears throat> One of the other products that has, has been very popular for us has been the underlayments, uh, whether it's the floor leveler, a level topping or an exterior level topping. We have those options as well, but more importantly, we also have the tools available for you. If you look in that picture and you can see that blue barrel in the back, that barrel will include the tools that you will need for that job if you don't have them already. So again, we just wanna make sure that when you're on the job site, there's no surprises. When you need it, we've got what you need. <clears throat> And of course, no job is complete without a cure and seal or a cure or a sealing membrane or curing membrane, sorry. Um, but here's just a, a photo of our product selection guide for cure and seals. And of course, on the next one, you'll see our curing membranes and there's a selection guide for that as well. And again, if you don't know what you're gonna need based on the, the job you're doing and the conditions that you're in, we have people that specialize just in chemical and they, We'll talk chemical all day with you, probably longer than you want to talk chemical, but they're here for you. So whenever you have questions, whatever you need, do not hesitate to reach out for us. We have people that have trained for years on different products in people that have real world experience all over the country on different job sites. There isn't much somebody in this company hasn't seen. So if you need help, we not only have the products, but we have the knowledge and the resources for it. So I wanna thank you guys very much for spending some time with us. And now I'm gonna send it back to Heidi so she can talk to you a little bit about the recap 
and some other resources that we have. Awesome. Thanks, Andy. So yeah, some resources. Um, Andy segued from the selection guide. We have tons of things on datesperior.com's website. I started the presentation letting you know that. Uh, we have handbooks, technical data sheets, safety data sheets. We have brochures in many cases, as well as engineering service pages. There's a who to call page right at the top level. You, If you need to know who your sales representative or technical representative or even customer service contact is, there is a map that is easy to read and able to tell you uh, who to contact based on who is in the territory. So you've heard from Andy, and he is the Director of Business Infrastructure. I wanted to include this because he is also a resource. He is the person who can put all of this together for you in situations like this, and there is his email address for contacting. So, do you require additional training? Go ahead and scan this. I'll leave it up here for just a minute. And what it does is it, it uh, sends an email to Chuck and myself. And if you need more customized or you see something in here that you really like, maybe the chemicals. We just told you what we have uh, based on this type of construction situation. But if you just want to talk chemicals and understand their uses, the resources, the curing, whatever, like Andy said, we have the people that can do that for you. And we can get you in touch with them. Chuck can come out and do a customized presentation, or we could do a lunch and learn here. In addition, we've got um, all of the other Training Tuesdays, like I mentioned before, just search on Training Tuesday on DaytonSuperior.com, and they're right there at your fingerprint, or yeah, fingerprint, <laughs> at your fingers. So basically those point to the YouTube, um, and they are all out there on Dayton superior.com. So I want to share some really exciting news. We had the 1st of May hit yesterday. Maybe some of you have seen this in your email, but we have special pricing on select safety project or products. Specifically what you saw today, the A93C SureGuard bracket, but in addition, we have it on the D48 SureGuard rebar protector. And all of that is only on special for May, so just contact your sales representative for details. And um, there you have it. So that's exciting. Are there any questions? Go ahead and you can put those in the chat functionality through Zoom and we will get Andy uh, to answer those. Or if there is one that is super high tech, we can get you the answer later by contacting one of our many uh, technical representatives that we have for you. So while I give you a minute to write in the chat if there are questions, just to wanna remind you that we do record all of these. I just said that we put them on YouTube. Remember, they're at your fingertips. <laughs> so go ahead, and uh, this one will be out there later. I'll let you know with an email. Every week on Tuesdays at 1 o'clock Eastern time, we have these training Tuesdays. And we try to do them with different people as our uh, product experts. We get them involved so that you can learn their names and understand who we have here at Dayton Superior and Simons. And, um, yeah, it's a different topic, so we hope that you enjoy that. And if there's no questions, then I will go ahead and leave it at that. Go ahead and sign up for next week. We're going to be talking quality. So I want to thank you all for joining and have a great Tuesday. Thanks, everyone.